Hey, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy Jack Elite Fitness right here. And today's pre warm up before I uh, go into my actual workout is going to consist of some re rehabilitation exercises and some soft tissue work. Basically, what I'm doing is I'm putting this foam roller on my hip flexor, which I strained the other day when I was squatting. So I'm just rolling over it, making sure that I'm hitting any tight spots. And any tight spots, I'm just going to lean on it and roll over it, basically. You want it to kind of hurt, but you don't want it to hurt too bad. You just want to kind of like massage it out a little bit. After we roll out, what we're going to be doing is a little bit of glute activation right here. I uh, hurt my left side, so I'm going to just be doing this glute activation with my left side. So after I get done rolling, I'm going to... Yeah, so on my left side, I'm going to be doing a modified glute raise. And I'm going to do like maybe 5 to 10. And then I'm going to move it to the wall. And all I'm going to do is keep going from this foam roller to my exercise of the glute raise. Just to get everything warmed up and get everything in balance to help it heal properly. So if you want to try something different to activate your glutes, this is something that I thought of when I was at the gym. Basically, I'm just moving it to the wall. Um, it's the same thing as a glute bridge from the floor, but you're just standing up. And on the opposite leg, you're going to be going to your tippy toe, and it helps with the extension of your hips. So if you're tall like me and you got long legs, this may be useful for you. But if you have short legs, it may not. So therefore, here's a different modification of the exercise. <laughs> 